Rangers lead into the Gulf of Mexico and where the hockey team's fan loyalty runs deep. Their team is home tonight. Their team is the Tampa Bay Lightning. Greetings, everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro in just a moment. I'm Mike Emery. Tonight on the ice, we have a leader in the league in plus-minus statistics. It was controversial for a number of years. As a matter of fact, the NHL wouldn't even adopt it for the longest time, while other leagues had it. What do you think of the plus-minus stat? Well, when I was plus, I loved it. When I was negative, I did not like it at all, Doc. But I think more than anything else is that what situations are you playing against? Are you playing against the other team's top guys? Are you playing against their top defensive players? So I think it's all about the situation is in when you're on the ice for or when you're on the ice against. It all comes down to matchups. And the teams that have the puck a lot uh, are going to have a lot of pluses in their column. Let's look at the starting netminders. Corey Crawford is the goalie of choice for this game tonight. Native of Chateauguay, a suburb of Montreal, and grew up watching the legendary Hall of Famer Patrick Waugh in goal. A New Year's Eve baby he was in 1984. Mason's the last line of defense for the Flames. Notice the goals against average. That tells you he has bailed out his team a few times. The Flames have had an excellent last 10 games, and they're full of confidence. They were telling us this morning, even though their opponents have had an excellent last 10 games as well, they feel they're the better team. Calgary's moving the puck up the wing, and picked up now by Grabner. Puck taken behind the net by Bumis. Fantastic shutdown. Puck is thrown to Gabriel. It's a three on two. How will they defend this? Didn't get through. Directing that one to Landeskog. And drives on through center. Good save there. Pitching this one to Gabra. Looks ahead to start something. The Flames shifting gears back in their own end. That one fired down. The defense will win the race. And icing is caught. And we're happy to have Ray Ferraro with us as well. He is down near the ice. Crawford's had an excellent season so far. He's got a high winning percentage. Way more wins than losses. He's made enough saves that gives his team a chance to get their feet underneath them when they don't play very well. But he's been pretty consistent this year. We'll see if the opposition can get somebody in his eye. Hit he got that one. An unbelievable stop from a high scoring area. Wonderful, great glove grab. Snapping a pass to Palmieri. Now it's directed to Camilleri. Opportunity, but the pass didn't connect. Terrific stop, but it's loose. Tampa Bay's waiting to get things organized in the defensive zone. And the puck control by Martinez. Berglund's got this one between the blue lines. Three on one, you can just spell a goal. Oh, that's a great save by Mason. Oh, a save there. And the loose puck gathered in by Reed. For the blast, he missed the net. That's a quality chance on the backhand opportunity. The Flames continue on in the defensive zone. That one comes right on his stick. Not very long, but good. Thrown to the slot. Big sweeping save. A cover and play is stopped. Crawford's cat-like reflexes put to work on that great chance. What a glove hand. A little over eight minutes to be played here in the first. Nothing on the scoreboard has changed. Still a pair of zeros. And possession now on the pickup by Whiteman. Another solid pad save. Referee over to the penalty box, and let's find out. Calgary's two-minute penalty is a minor, and the call is booking. The referees are looking for this. Anytime you stop skating and reach with your stick and pull on the opponent, you're going to the penalty box. Tampa Bay's power play often gives them an advantage in any game that they play. I think that'll be the case tonight, Doc, as their power play is much better than their opponents. But discipline will also play a key factor here tonight, Doc, as if they can stay out of the penalty box and keep the better power play off the ice, they should be in decent shape. Trying to go to Johansson. They've got a two-on-one. What a brilliant job to break up that rush. 
gathered in by Fowler to Boychuk. Tampa Bay's got it and moving it through the neutral zone. He's in on an onside play. Marvelous save. No time on that one. The goalie makes himself look big. Good quick stick. And the puck taken hold of by Fowler. The Flames are back even. On to Bomeister. Splendid pass through center to Umberger. Puck gathered in the defensive zone by Fowler. To Johansson. Near the boards. Big drive! Terrific love save! Gets play stopped. I don't know if he's going to make a save much easier than that one. He's in good position. It's a rather routine stop. Nice face-off work. Moving it to Gabrick. Calgary setting it up as they move through center. One-timer. Score! Boy, that's a beautiful one-time shot there, but how about the pass? You're going to be setting the table for somebody that's getting ready to one-time that puck. You have to lay it perfectly in between the two skates to allow that shooter to get the most that he can on that shot. Calgary's been able to break the scoreless tie, but can they build on this? The Flames control from the neutral zone. It's a three-on-two as they move in. Tampa Bay's on the move in the defensive zone. Slid to Goudreau. Chip the Hayes. Let's it go. Score! And this one is tied. That shot was all about speed. That was a nasty shot. Mason's read of the play is pretty curious here. He stays on his feet. When you do that, you open up the low stick side where the shot beat him. Inside the final minute of the period. The Flames have control of the puck at center ice. Chipped right back into the opposite corner. Takes it behind his own cage. Wonderful save. What a skill level there. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. First period done. Two goals scored. One aside. Present your ticket stub from tonight's game and receive up to 10% off of your meal at Buzzville Burgers Family Restaurant. Tampa Bay's goal, this goal, got this game tied again. What will happen next? We'll see when we return right after this. Tie score, second period underway. That one's cornered on the dump. Corralled by Boychuk. Great job stopping and holding. Perfect tip by the stick. Tampa Bay's in their own end and on the move. Takes it up near the boards. Big drive. Oh, what a great chance, but it's off the iron. The Flames waiting back in the defensive zone. Continues right between the blue lines. A shot, terrific save there. Didn't look like he had anything to shoot at, and he made it tough. Seems like he was in too tight on the goaltender. Look at this, a three on one. Blocker it away. Laid on to Goudreau. Up the wing. Pass, got it all. There was some room. Not enough. Great glove save. Grabner's been shaking his head since he had this wide open net. And the only thing he could find was iron. A little over six minutes played here in the second. Scrappy game. Both of these teams have connected once. Calgary's got it again. Shoots. He missed the net with the shot. You have to give yourself a chance here. You cannot. Big time save. Big time shooter.
Routine stop for the goaltender. The shooter's going to have to do a much better job challenging him. Quick work on the faceoff. Let's it go. Taken on by Earhart. To Orvik. Pitching it to Lakewan. Shooting! Grab! The goalie gave him the glove side, and he took it away. What a stop. Crawford's looking around, wondering where everybody else is, but he had to make a save on an odd man rush. The Flames win the draw. Shoots one. Keeps it going back behind the net. Propelled to Richards. Pass attempt to Hayes. He takes that pass right off the left wing. Great glove save, but it's loose. Could this be icing? And it will be, based on the defense arriving first. Mason stretched out as far as he can go. He just got a chunk of that shot. Solid clean win. Looking to Klingberg. Takes it up that side. Brings a shot. Score! Close stick was in a ready position and he one time to pass the goalie. The passer recognizes that he's got to get the puck up in the air, but he displays sweet hands as it goes just over the stick and lands flat on the ice. The Flames have taken the lead by one. What fork in the road are we headed for with this faceoff? A faceoff win. Let's see what develops. Puck fired down, decision made, defenders first, icing. Goodrow's creativity has been on display most of the season as he has among the highest total points in the league. A little under seven minutes left to go here in the second. We had a tie game until just moments ago. It's a one goal contest. Clean win on the draw. Calgary's got it in center ice. And the loose puck captured by Boychuk. Passing one off now to Burroughs. The refs caught something, a delayed call here. Calgary's got a penalty up on the board. It's two minutes for Elboy. More times than not, Doc, when you lead with your elbow, you're going to get a penalty. Tampa Bay's power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. The Flames with a face-off win. Wanting to generate something here in the defensive zone. Gathered in by Fowler. One-timer. Calgary's in control of the puck in their own end and readying an attack. They shot it back down. Now they can get ready for another rush. Puck is thrown to Miko Koivu. And he dumps it in. Clock leading down on the power play. Tampa Bay's in their own end and in possession. Gathered in by Miko Koivu. Calgary's penalty kill comes through. Wonderful save. Great job on a cut pass. Gains the zone. Really good deflection. No harm. Tampa Bay's continuing on in their own end. Directing that one to Johansson. Shoots. Outstanding glove save. That one fired down. The defense will win the race, and icing is called. I don't know if he's going to make a save much easier than that one. He's in good position. It's a rather routine stop. Calgary's got a face-off win. On to Weidman. Pitching this one to Airhawk. 
And that is the end of the second period of this game. One more to go, and who knows, maybe more action beyond that. Shots on goal can be deceptive. You decide whether they are in this game or not. 11 for the Lightning, and 11 for Calgary. Closed goal was pretty good, but is it the difference maker? It is for right now. We had to break. Third period about to begin. What did you think of the second? Tampa Bay's had very little time of possession, Doc. They've been outplayed in that category big time, but they're still in this game. One shot, and they're right in. Opening face-off of the third period. Wrist shot. Outstanding save with the glove. Oh, he thought he had him on the glove side. And the puck is seized by Marion Gabbard. Slid to Grabner. Moves it to the shadow of the boards. That is defense. Oh, what a break. That shot hit somebody. Oh, and here's a three on two. But what a save, considering the shooter that's usually in. Great shooting position. Let's go, Arister. Oh, another save. Ripped along to Gabriel. Plays a little catch here. Snapping a pass to Cromwell. One-timer. Masterful save of an overwhelming one-time shot. Good centering pass to the slot. Accidentally blocked. Goalies will take that one. Nice tip of the pass. And the possession taken by... Outstanding save with the glove. Stays on side to the middle. Puck is grabbed by Burton. And now it's directed to Palmieri. Trying to go to Camilleri. Good hustle. Won the race. Beat the icing. Chip to Berglund. Possession still through the neutral zone. Great job on a cut pass. Shoots one. And a good save there. Pass to the shooting position. Callen's hooked on the play. There will be a penalty. Hammered. Oh, what a glove he's got there. Calgary's roster goes down by one here. At least briefly, a minor penalty for hooking. Well, what he was trying to do is try to get the puck, but unfortunately for him, he reached in and hooked around the player. Off to the penalty box he goes. Well, the power plays had some good opportunities so far here tonight. They have to stay with their game plan. You got it, Eddie. Let's see. The power play is just about to begin. Offside is called. Somebody got over anxious there. The Flames prevail on the draw. Crawford's out behind to stop it right there. Could be trouble near the line. Shifts to the backhand and shoots. Too wide. Moves behind the net. Tampa Bay is controlling play now in the defensive zone. Right along the blue line. Brilliant save by Mason. A quality chance, a better save. He can start some danger here. Good use of the stick. Broke that pass up. Back in his defensive end to get it. Calgary's penalty kill came up large on this one. Corralled by Gabriel Landeskog. Moving it to Orpik. He missed the net! You put that puck in, that ices the game. Gathered in, it's off his path. To Johansson. Pitching it to Landeskog. Picks it up in his own end. And fired straight up to Landeskog. In the slot. Got the pad on it. Puck. You know what, Doc? Instead of acting like this after the whistle, how about both teams play whistle to whistle like this? Guys, they're relying on their goaltender here to hold their lead. They're lucky he's been so sharp. An enormous defensive face-off win. Pass attempt to Gabrick. 
A pro outstanding save. What magic to even get the shot away. A missed opportunity from this close in. Tampa Bay setting things up in center. Good intercept. Hoping for better things if he turns back. To Bomeister. Possession taken over by Boychuk. To Fowler. Looking to Berglund. Up the wing with it now. Right near the line. Can he keep it going? Calgary is in their own end and has possession. Goalie is gone. Extra man coming on. And possession established on the pickup by Fowler. Looks ahead to start something. Intercepted pass. Calgary's forced another turnover in this very close game. Taken away. And that one is sailed back in. Camilleri's play there is at a critical point in the game. That's a smart play. Crawford's going to have to be sharp if they keep giving up man advantage breaks. Another good stop. That is a large win by the defensive centerman. Off his pass. The clock is at zeros. The game is over. This game was a close game, and it was a little bit deceptive that way because of the victor's time of possession. Could have thrown two or three pucks out there, and they were going to have all of them all at the same time. Solid performances all around in a terrific hockey game. We hope you liked it. We'll all look forward to next time. Good night from all of us.